happy Wednesday. We are here with another episode of Quotes to Live By where I pick a quote for each week that I hope will inspire you to think a little bit and that you can apply to your everyday life. So this week I picked a quote from Stephen Furtick. Um, he is a pastor and a author and, and speaker. Um, and the quote is, the reason we struggle with insecurity is because we compare our behind the scenes with someone else's highlight reel. And that is something that I think applies to us so much, even more so today than it did maybe 10 years ago before social media was really big because we are constantly seeing everyone's highlight reels. And I think that you need to really check yourself and um, your mind when you see these things because you're not seeing what's going on behind the scenes. You really are only seeing everyone's highlight reels. Um, and this goes for people that you see in the media that are huge successes that seem to be overnight successes. It's really just their highlight reels. You're not seeing what they've done and all the work that they've put in to get there. Um, so I think we need to kind of mentally just remind ourselves that, you know, you should be happy for those people with those highlights, but also remind yourself to not get discouraged and to keep working hard and to focus on what you're trying to do with your life and uh, pursuing because you just can't compare yourself to everyone's highlight reel. And I just pulled a few things um, off the internet. It's, uh, it's actually from Founder Magazine. They created this pretty cool, easy info infographic to read um, about some really famous people and just to kind of remind you and uh, that even the biggest success stories, they've worked hard and have failed numerous times before they've got there. So a lot of us know about Michael Jordan being cut from his high school basketball team. Um, Oprah Winfrey was uh, demoted from her job, um, first job as a news anchor at a television station. Walt Disney was fired from a newspaper because they said he was lacking imagination and had no original ideas. Um, Albert Einstein didn't speak until he was four years old and his teachers told him that he would never amount to anything. Colonel Sanders couldn't uh, sell any of his chicken. He went to over a thousand restaurants and was rejected before opening KFC. And Henry Ford failed three times in business before he finally was a success at the age of 53 with Ford Motor Company. So I just wanted to use these examples of some really public figures and show you that everyone that has reached a pinnacle of success has had numerous failures. And this goes with business just because these people have had successful careers. So just remind yourself to keep climbing and keep pushing on because it takes a lot of failures to reach the the point of success and I remind myself of this daily too and even just the little things if you're seeing small little successes and highlights about people's lives on social media it can really cause you if you focus too much on all these highlights and maybe things aren't exactly where you want in your life it may cause you to feel a little down and depressed and wondering why you're not there yet or why the good things aren't happening to you yet. But just remember that, you know, these are highlights that everyone sees in the media and everything. And um, obviously we want everyone to have success, but also just keep in mind, you know, everyone struggles and everyone has been there at some point, you know, no one becomes a success overnight. And if they do, they're very lucky. So again, just stop comparing your behind the scenes with someone else's highlight reel. And I hope that you can kind of take this with uh, as a little bit of encouragement with you today. And we will see you next week for another quote to live by. All right, take care everyone. Mm -hmm.